Okay, well, thank thanks everybody for uh, coping with a, a bit of a latency here. Um, but we're really, really excited about this week in particular. And is nobody... It, is this going to be like bands when they're like, yeah. you're the you're best crowd we've ever played? <laughs> uh, probably probably not. Because <laughs> uh, I'm going uh, be, to be going through a big learning curve here today. Yes, yes. So you've yeah. never played Pokemon. I have never been a part of the Pokemon culture. No, okay, hold on. Uh, slightly. I was um, Pokemon Go on my uh, iPhone. I did that. And that was a lot of fun, but I didn't necessarily understand what I was doing. Fair. You know what I mean? I didn't understand who the characters were, who, you know, how they fit in the culture of Pokemon. But I did know that it was a huge culture of people because it seemed to jump on right away. Yeah. Yeah. yeah you know yeah. what I mean? You're right. So did you say meow, meow, meow? Meow, meow, meow. meow, meow. meow, meow. <laughs> <laughs> cool. Well, uh, uh, to give you a little bit of a brief overview of what we're going to do today... Yeah. Uh, we're going to discuss Pokemon. That's going to be our primary focus of conversation. But you know, we are we are we are dynamic people. We're going to talk about a lot of things today. Mm. Um, we're going to get PJ to play Pokemon Blue for the first time. I'm now, about it. I really wanted you to play on this Game Boy Color, but uh, let's let's assume, if we can, that everybody who's watching right now doesn't have a lot of experience with yeah. uh, Game Boys, or they don't have a lot of experience with maybe even the beginning of Pokemon. Yes, right? yes. Um, uh, it, it certainly spiraled into the massive industry that it is right now, but what does that mean in regards to where it all started, which is this? Yeah. Well, to give you a little bit of a fun fact, yeah. um, Pokemon is the most successful media franchise ever. 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 Now, you, you, that's including Marvel Comics, yeah. all, Disney, all that stuff. Pokemon wow. is the most successful media franchise of all time. And I like that you said media in particular. And because they're larger than just games or cards, like there's an entire deep culture, much like Marvel. Yes. Yeah. 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 I mean, you got to catch them all in more ways than one. That's the catchphrase. <laughs> Do you have to catch them all or can you just catch a few? Well, you see there's two ways you go about Pokemon. You you got the battling guys yep. and you got the catching guys. Okay. So, I've always been more of like a I want to get my team together. I don't necessarily care about catching them all. I want to battle them. All uh, that stuff. Those are all words that I don't even know. Yeah. Well, that's good. I'm realizing I'm not so, even in the mix here. So, uh, so the reason I wanted you to play on the Game Boy is to kind of give you a little bit of an idea of how hard, how far we've come as yep. far as viewing these things. Well, okay, this is not unlike everybody's got a Nintendo Switch. And it, look, let me be clear. I grew up with this as well. I don't have an original Game Boy, which saddens me big time. Mm. I have my, oh, hold on a second, hold on. So, so for me in particular, I've got my Nintendo DS, which you know became a staple with me. Uh, I've got my D a 3DS, um, which once again upgrade from that. But these these all are core from the Game Boy. Yeah. And this is a color version of the Game Boy. Just did for you reference? So did you have an original Game Boy? I never had an original Game. Boy. Did you have a color? I never had a color. My first portable. Device. I think my first portable Nintendo was this DS. Oh, wow. Even though I grew up in a time where this existed, I always had like a re like a standard classic Nintendo on mm. the um, console. It's called a console. So you never had the clip-on backlight that they used to have. What? Oh, man, I got to find a picture of that. That was Game Boy monstrosity. Monstrosity. So, so in order to read the screen... Um, you could get like this backlight thing for it. Yeah. Oh uh, my gosh! It was like a magnifying glass. Oh, <laughs> like for for reading tip uh, the tip receipts and such. Oh man, yeah. Um, bring up my uh, yeah. Bring up my iPad. I yeah. Full screen is. Oh wait, this, this guy. This is going actually pretty. Low. Yeah, this guy. Oh my, this is my favorite one. Oh wait, I gotta turn down the. Bu So yeah, you could buy like these attachments. Oh my goodness. For when you're on the bus? Yeah. If you can see it right here. I can't figure out how to full screen this picture. Yeah. It's embarrassing. But yeah, you could get speakers. You get a magnifying glass. You could get a uh, backlight for it as well. And yeah, that was the, the light boy. Oh yeah. 
Jeez. Yeah, it was, a, it was dark times. Well, accessory culture, right? <laughs> Quite literally. So that when you're sitting on the bus and you're playing the game, yeah, or if you had terrible, uh, if you had terrible vision for that matter, you could at least see your game. <laughs> you could see eight bit in. Oh, it's not even eight bit. Oh, it's eight bit. Uh, in better resolution. Resolution from a f- so, further distance. So um, I didn't have. I didn't have. I don't think I had the clip light right away. But actually, fun story. Oh my gosh, my microphone. Ugh, crazy. So mics. flustered here. Yeah. Um, we. Uh, I begged, I beg. I think I had Pokemon Blue first. Mm-hmm. Had a Game Boy Color. Correct me if I'm wrong. Blue is the very first game. So yeah, blue and blue and red. Okay. So and we, we have to get into the how they always come in pairs, which is an aspect of the game. That's interesting. I'd never noticed that until you said that right yeah, now. Yeah, they okay. come in pairs. Cool. Okay. So so uh, I had Pokemon Blue. Yeah. Which is the the first, the best. Yikes. Um, By the way, do we have chat going up here? Yep, I have chat open oh, for you. you. Okay, yeah, yeah, good. Okay. Um, so so uh, well, I think it was 1999. Okay. It happened. Pokemon Yellow was coming out. So the, the primary difference between Pokemon Yellow and Pokemon Blue and Red is that Pokemon Yellow followed the story of the anime. So in, in Pokemon Blue, what you'll find out is you have to st- you pick your starters. Yeah. And... You, there was no real way you could get all of the starters unless you traded for them. Okay. Because trading is a big element of this game. You have this. Which I do get the. You had the Game Boy Link cable. Oh. To connect two Game oh, Boys wait a together. Minute, wait a minute. Did I, did I see the little sneaksies in there? Uh, do you have another Game Boy in there? Bruh. Bruh, yeah. Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> I, ah. Oh, no. They're, they're indestructible. So, yeah, you had, to, you had to trade to get the, all the starters. Yeah. So the big deal behind Pokemon Yellow was that it was it followed the story of the, the story of the I guess the anime is that what they call it I guess the so. correct, correct It'd be anime. yeah absolutely um, so you're yeah. Ash Ketchum and you get to ca- and you start with a Pikachu yeah. uh, as with the story and then you get the chance to collect all the, the starters okay um, so I begged for this game I was like th- I was want to say I was like 13 okay. maybe 12 I would have been 12 yeah so beg for the game Christmas is coming you know the drill. But uh, my stupid twelve-year-old brain didn't understand because we were going to uh, we were going to New Zealand for a month. La di da. For uh, for Christmas time. Nice. And uh, my stupid twelve-year-old brain didn't understand that they didn't have Pokemon down in New Zealand, so I wasn't going to get it. Wait, why not? I don't know why. That's just that's just the way of thinking. The so okay, that makes sense. So it's pretty crushed that I. Wasn't going to get Pokemon for Christmas because, you know, we're going to the Southern Hemisphere. They don't have that down there. Below the equator, it's a very, <laughs> very different place. Yeah. yeah. So, so, lo and behold, Christmas Miracle, got it. Best time ever. Yes. Um, but fast forward to the summertime, a uh, good friend of mine and, my, and our dads were going to Sturgis, South Dakota, which is like a guitar, or not a guitar, excuse me, a motorcycle. A motorcycle oh, yeah, ride. yeah. So, me and my friend and our dads, I rode on the back of my dad's motorcycle, him on his, and it's a five-day drive on the back of a motorcycle. Whoa. So we played our Game Boys on the back. So you, we uh, have pictures. The back of... We're like this the whole time. You didn't need, you didn't need the accessory <laughs> no, to be you, able to see. You, you couldn't use it. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, Pokemon runs deep. Yeah, Pokemon. Days of just – well, now it – Without being on the back of a motorcycle, but nowadays it would be like in the back seat of a car. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. And with an on an iPad is typically what anybody yeah. now would do. Give right? the kids the iPad to shut them up. Yeah, yeah. And, and or the Nintendo Switch for that matter. Yeah. Um, but you lived through. A, there would have been like ten days of driving. It feels like I was going to say a little bit more excruciating. Yeah. Uh, but you had that and nothing else. It's not like you could just. Yeah. Change up to your CD player or something like that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, CDs. 